Popeye in one of the world's most popular musicals about a founding father is now streaming. Hamilton is available right now on Disney+. Plus. This morning, we are lucky enough to be joined by Neil Haskell, who was part of the cast when the show stopped in Omaha last summer. Good morning, Neil. Good morning. How are you doing? I'm great. How are you? Good, thank you. Well, first off, Neil, I wanted to talk to you about um, who did you play when you were on tour here in Omaha? Uh, I was King George. And how was yeah. and how was that? Was that he was kind of a, a funny character? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I love playing that role. You get to come on stage, sing three songs a night, and um, the audience automatically either cheers or boos. <laughs> <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, I love it. So you're actually part of the original cast. So who were you in the original show? Uh, in the original Broadway show, I was a swing, um, which meant I knew um, six parts. Um, all the male ensemble parts, which are all the, the dancers and Charles Lee and George Eaker and uh, James Reynolds, I would go on for any of them um, when, whenever any of them were sick or injured or on vacation or needed the day off or whatever the circumstance. Um, uh, me and one other guy would um, go on for them. So, yeah. Now, do you remember when they were filming this for Disney Plus? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it was uh, in the summer of 2016, actually. Oh, wow. I didn't realize yeah. it was that many years ago. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They wanted to, you know, um, uh, sort of encapsulate what the original cast was mm -hmm. and the only time you can do that is when the original cast is still there. So this was right before um, um, most of the original cast started uh, leaving the show. Wow. Well, yeah. what makes this viewing experience different from per se seeing it live? Um, uh, I would say the for this, you have the best seat in the house and the best angle of the show. Um, Tommy, the director, um, shot this in such a smart way where he he points out exactly where he wants you to see it and exactly where he would have wanted you to be looking had you been seeing it live. Um, and so hopefully people will see this and when uh, theaters are able to reopen again, um, people will be just as energized to come see it live. Yeah, no, what, what does this mean for the show to be available in this way during um, the pandemic? Um, it's, it's interesting. I, I think it's, it's an amazing way to keep um, arts in people's homes and in people's minds and in people's hearts. And um, it's just a really, really, really special, unique way to be able to share the show with people. Okay, Neil. Well, before we go, is there anything that you want to let people at home know? Um, I'd say uh, enjoy the enjoy it. Um, you know, treat it like you're seeing the show uh, live. You know, get dressed up or have some popcorn or um, anything like that, <laughs> and uh, <laughs> and you know, just uh, enjoy it. Thank you.